good old fashioned standing curls. Yep. Don't go too crazy with the weight. No. Just the nice warm up. Getting them warmed up. Starting with biceps. Yeah. Usually different. you start with triceps. Usually start with tries and the barber curls and uh, dumbbells preacher standard and Frank McGrath may come or he might be still eating. Dunno. He might make an appearance. Fifteen of the finest. Pretty good. Fifteen fine reps. You think that new Fiat that plane got? Oh, the Fiat. Yeah. How'd it go? Fiat. Yeah, delicious. Actually, when you um, I took it for a ride this morning. Got some breakfast. And when you like flat foot it, it like the exhaust pops after it changes gear into the next, into the second gear. So you got to. Like, it's good though. It like crackles. Sounds like fun. Yeah, it's fun. It's actually really good for LA. Yeah, it would be. You can almost fit like a regular car in one lane, another car in another lane, and you can almost fit it like in the white, like go in the middle lane between cars. That's uh, two sets, do two more. Another plate, each rep, each set? Yeah, another plate each side, and then one more. Just keep going up. 20 pounds strong. Ouch. How many reps do you get? 10. So would you do 15, 12, 10 so far? Yeah, 15, 12, 10. We'll probably do one more. Eight reps. Yeah. What's your favorite bicep exercise? Do you have an absolute all time favorite? Um, Probably, probably preacher curls. Yeah. Pretty well seated, preachers? nah, seated. Probably seated preacher curl. I'll do them at the end. That's good. Pretty hungry today. Yeah, he chased down that mouse. He actually, he actually jumped. Out. He high jumps up in the air for his food. I'm teaching him tricks. Good lighting, I think. Someone lost their dog. Someone lost their dog. Kinky workouts. And you got like a leash or something. I guess. What is that? Is that for your um, forearms and you attach like a weight to it? Broke it. Well, I guess it's not very useful. Shit. Look, I just broke it. Sorry, Gold Jim. Oh. Sheep. Kick it under there. Never look at it again. If we had to wait for France, I mean, 
Uh, yeah, France is coming. Uh, just got to stop over at Paris and then I'll see you at Torrance and then last year at that. No, if Frank didn't come, yeah, if we, we waited for Frank, we'd not be bicep pumped right now. Sugar? Oh yeah? Thank you. Just one more. What's your favorite favorite color? Red. Red? Everyone knows red's the best. Spy truck. Haven't done this one before. What's that? Oh, this one. What the f is this thing? Is that for your back leg? For me, it's for chicks. It's a self defense machine. So if they ever get attacked, the knee, do the nuts. Get a real powerful knee action. Is that right? I think that's what it's for, yeah. Knee someone, the, knee someone in the dick sack. I don't know. What is it really for? I have no idea. I guess you can do one. <laughs> I don't know. Hip flexes? Hey, what are you supposed to do? Oh, I guess. Is that it? I think that's it. I guess you can do multiple things, right? Yeah. It's got many different purposes. It's a four way machine. Whatever tickles your fancy that day. like a preacher machine but actually no this is like a dumbbell incline but a machine yeah pretty good what does it work on yeah the peaks no nah, the the inner head boxer because you're twisting it out It's like the famous gold gym theme, isn't it, right there? Oh, this song, yeah. Whatever the frick it is. And then they use that Skrillex bit as well. <laughs> what do you like better? Biceps first or triceps first? I actually like trying before a bind, but... Well, I've been doing that for a while actually. Tries and then by. So you feel like it's a bit of a mix up now? Yeah, a bit of a mashup. Mashup. Uh, I'll change it, but I always change it. Like, I'll do something for a month and I'll change it up. Change the routine. So you get optimal muscle growth. Keep the body guessing. You gotta shock the muscles, right? <laughs> Thought you'd get over it. Not gonna grow up, it's not heavy enough. <laughs> So what's the goal now, extra size? You know what? I was talking about this today, but yes. The goal is, for the rest of the year, just, uh, just put on mass. Like for the next few months, I want to bulk up. Put on some, some more size. And uh, no comps this year. We, uh, I, w I wish I could be competing. I almost was going to sign up for one in November, but I'm due to be uh, away 
and doing some filming and some other stuff. So too many interruptions to probably actually get a show on my belt this year, unfortunately. So that's alright, I'll just train and hopefully bulk up and then shoot for next year. How many pounds do you want to put on? 15. 15? Yeah, 15. Solid number. I've, I've been, the heaviest I've ever been was 117 kilos. That was filthy. So, I don't know, we'll see. We'll just see what the mirror says. If it looks good, it looks good. There's a very common thing, well, it's about to be common, going around the gym these days. And that is that you, you pull one, one part of your shorts up. If you're wearing shorts, just pull one up like that so that if other lifters look at you, your legs, then they don't have to ask you if you skip leg day because they know you don't. It's just like a sign of saying that you train legs. Maybe not today, maybe not the day before, but you have trained them. Four sets in this two? Yeah, four of and then probably maybe a dip and then see you later. And then Bob's your uncle, Bang's your aunt. Ah, surely actually. Surely. <laughs> really, seriously, you know, surely. <laughs> Top, I think, right? Yep. Living life? One day at a time. Koala gang? Koala gang? Living life amongst the gum trees? Yeah, home amongst the gum trees. That song was actually written by a koala. Uh, what, how does it go? Home amongst gum trees. With lots of plum trees. Cheap with two and a kangaroo. And a first one out the back. Something out the front. A cocky out the front and an old rocking chair. Yeah, that's it. Is that it? How do you remember that? I don't know. Oh, give me a home amongst the gum trees. With lots it? of palm trees. What's it even from? Sheep or two, oh, probably play school or something. Yeah. Sheep or two and a kangaroo. A clothes on out the back. A cocky two out the front and an old rocking chair. There you yeah. go. <laughs> <laughs> old sing Matilda, who bloody killed that lying on the grass with the dagger up her ass. Oh, where's that how it goes? I can't see Matilda. Remember singing songs at school? Yeah, I remember that. If you're yawning means you're <laughs> exhausting everything. I don't know if that's a good thing to be yawning in the gym. Yeah. Yeah. My triceps are yawning. Sorry. Nothing good on TV tonight. Oh, what, Game of Thrones. Have you watched it yet? No, nah, that's it good. Good episode. Oh, I can't remember. I was watching it and a mouse got out of its little, its little holding thing and so run across the Game of Thrones. Go on. Yeah, I was. What does Khaleesi say when she I don't know. orders a dragon to fire to... I don't know, what did she say? Something? Dracardus or some shit. She goes, Dracardus. Yeah. the fire, the dragon plays the fire. The bad. And I went Dracardus on the little mouse. I was like, ah. Are you still living in the house somewhere? Yeah, yeah, yeah. away. Yeah. Um, but yeah, I can't remember. It wasn't like a cr crazy episode. The one before it was, it was lit, mate. It was fucking lit. It was fire, it was so much fire. It was so lit, it was fire. It was so grilled. It was grilled. Yeah. <laughs> so spicy. Nah, no, sick. Fully, fully sick, mate. <laughs> 
time you do arms you'll switch the order around you'll do biceps second second uh, or think you'll keep this new approach for a little bit you know what i might even just completely go do buys with chest or something and do back and tries i don't know time for a change keep things fresh yeah that's what the movie's gonna be about that man right there joe weeder uh called bigger See it on IMDb. And you're gonna be in that movie? Sounds pretty cool. Yeah. You've been practicing your Austrian accent? No, but they're gonna get me an accent coach for it, so. Oh wow. Uh, they're gonna need to find the best in the world. <laughs> get to the chopper! Get no, to the I'm... chopper, mate! It's... <laughs> what did you redo? Really get to the chopper! It's not a tumor, alright? It's not a tumor. It's not a tumor. No! No, dude. Can you imagine if you went down like this and you f***ed it and you slip and just put it like... Oh like, yeah. That thing could hit you in the face. Could. Or I could hit it in the face. This is true, you could bend the bar in half. I could headbutt it. Just finished a really good workout, arm workout. Shane, my training buddy. Frank McGrath. Yeah. The ghost yeah. of Frank McGrath. Um, ghosted by Frank McGrath. He was actually spotting me. Uh, you just couldn't see him. Uh, he didn't want to be filmed today. See you, Frank. See you next week, mate. 